This is for all the beautiful black people out there who are pissed off about this. If you are pissed off about this, you have every right to be. Now I implore you to take that energy and take that anger about being pissed off about slave trauma films and put it into black creators, black novelists, black comic books. Because the only way you're gonna get more black movies where they're, that aren't trauma films, that are, you know, different stories and see us in different lights is if you support black creatives, black authors, black novelists, black creators, period. And trust me, I get it. We're getting Black Panther. We had Woman King, but a lot of us uh, rightfully so felt a way about it. Jordan Peele is knocking it out of part, but it's we all universally agree that it's not enough. If they can drop one slave film, they can drop two fantasy fix. Simple. In order to get what you want, you have to support black creators. You have to. As long as you get mad at and don't do it, white people are gonna go see this movie and they're gonna make it, it's gonna make enough money that they're gonna say, oh, the market still wants slave movies. So we're gonna make another slave movie, maybe three or four years. So again, support black creators. Matter of fact, support me. There you go, support me. Look at my description below. You can find my webtoons, you can find my Patreon, you can find my subscribe star, which is a little adult. Um, you can read my comic book for free, the black and white version, for free. Like, comment, and subscribe. So you can buy my novels. They're both on Amazon. The third one is going to be here December. Third and the final chapter of Judgment Day will be here in December. The only way we're going to get more black creatives in the cinema or on TV is if you support us. If you don't support us, what's going to continue to keep happening the same old same old bullshit like this and will smith will smith should have fucking known but then again he picks the movie so he chose more than likely chose this movie but white people are going to go see it and they're going to see that there's still a market in slave movies and they're going to keep making slave movies now if you want to see lichens vampires werewolves wiccans magic stuff like that support me i have it in my comic book i have it in my novels if you don't like reading i have a comic book I'm trying to get to the, I'm trying to get an animated film at some point. I'm trying to get a movie at some point. Can't do that if I don't have support. Please support me. But don't just support me. Support other black creatives because once they see, once the market, once these uh, big companies see that there's a market for black creators and black led things, they will start snatching up black stories like it's nothing. And they will start doing that. You just have to, for example, okay, Anne Rice has had, to my knowledge, three movies made of her um, novels, three movies. There's a new one coming, Anne Rice's uh, Interview with a Vampire. I think it's gonna supposed to be more accurate. Less um, liberties are gonna be taken for this one. Um, Anne Rice is an author, just like J.K. Rowling. She's an author, people loved her. You know what happened, they supported her. And now she has, what, four four movies? I'm pretty sure it's more than four. I just, I just don't know everything about Anne Rice. But if you want more, Black content, you need to support black creators. You know what I'm saying?